Hey guys, Joe for Up Reviews, and today we've got a sneaker review and unboxing of the Crux Echo Storm. Before we get into this review, guys, if you're new to our channel, remember to hit that subscribe button, hit that notifications bell so you never miss any of our latest reviews. Slap that thumbs up, helps us greatly. Drop some love in the comment section below. We try our best to reply to every single comment that's thrown out our way. I just wanted to take this time and opportunity to thank the subscribers, new and old. Without you guys, we can't do this. Thank you. Let's go, and today we've got a look at the Crux Echo Storm. We've got this in the Midnight colorway, in the UK size 7, it's European 41 to 42, and it's US 8. So this is kind of the first Crux shoe, I want to say. It's not really a sandal, it's not really a clog that you're familiar with, but here they are. It's essentially a shoe, basically. So this is part of Crocs' Echo family. It's a very modern or sporty take on the traditional clog and other silhouettes that you're familiar with when it comes to Crocs. And it kind of sparked that debate where Saladi Bambri, you know, his shape, the shape that he had for his Pollux, the Echo kind of resembled to that. And this kind of reminds me of the echo clock because of the shape and you can see the inspiration from like a uh, Everachi because it's essentially a sock liner that's incorporated in here but we'll get into the detailing soon we'll start off with the outsole so with the outsole first you've got kind of pa panels right there where the rubber for your traction but essentially it's a foam one that you'll find from Crocs Lite that the Crocs are famous for and you've got a Crocs logo in the middle with the sizing also. Uh, the main upper is again it's an injected foam it's that Crocs light technology that's all around very lightweight as the name suggests Crocs light and then you look at the main body it's kind of like stitched on to this sock so it's a neoprene sock so you can just slip your feet right in and you've got all the like little grooves, the shape. It's very different in this design. Essentially, this is a shoe. You've got a pull tab right here at the front and at the back. And then you've got, again, that famous Crocs footbed right there for you. Really dope in this design. Really cool, very new. And it's kind of like, um, what I'm gonna hope for when it comes to Sally Bembry's next project, which is which is this Juniper, which is a new croc shoe. And that was kind of designed for hiking. Whereas this is more casual, lightweight, you know, you can wear this as a shoe, I guess, or in stores, however you wanna wear it. Um, very different in its design, very modern take. Uh, I'm really excited to try this on. So, here I am going to try these Echo Storm for you. When it comes to the fit guys, I recommend that you get your a, heart, a size down to what you typically wear for your clogs, the classic ones. I, so I wear a UK size eight, but this is a seven. These fit fine. Um, I did go with the size that I wear my Celine Benbury Pollux because it's kind of similar. So that is what I did. And I typically wear a UK size seven. And these are really cool on. Very lightweight, that's what I'm expecting. Very futuristic, I guess, in the, in the look. It's very forward. Um, and the only gripe is, is that one of this, maybe it's the socks I'm wearing, it's a bit, it feels a bit slippery inside. But apart from that, they're really comfy. 
That's why I actually want to learn a pair of Crocs. Thanks so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow us at 1UpReviews on Instagram and on TikTok. Till next time, peace.